this kid could make a game out of absolutely anything. His one job is to water the chickens. But he's too busy throwing the little chicken water <laughs> into the trough like a football. This child of mine, let me tell you, he is something else. Something else. Because, sorry, this is too bright. Uh, all he has to do is feed the animals. All he has to do is feed the critters. And he is making a game out of watering those chickens. Which cracks me up. It's fine. The job is getting done. Well, now the job is getting overdone because the water is pouring out of the trough and onto the ground. But the job is getting done nonetheless. Um, it's been a minute. I want to update you guys on kind of what has been going on. But I also have to get outside and do some weeding in the garden and get some stuff planted. With that, now it's too dark. Super. Okay, so... Super quick update, and then I'm going to go outside. Uh, Lincoln is going to mow today, so there's going to be a lot of noise, and you guys are not going to be able to hear anything if I try and talk to you outside. So in the meantime, thus far, we have moved Missy and Cutie Patootie and put them together. Uh, that was like a screaming squabble at first. Um, they definitely... We're not used to being with one another, and Cutie is very vocal, apparently. Missy kept trying to kind of push her around, and Cutie was not having it. So, she threw a royal fit, which is fine. It just sounded like someone was dying up here for a minute. Um, those two are together. We have their next pen set up of where they're going to go next. Uh, to kind of keep them on the rotation. That plan is hopefully going to happen this weekend. And then I am planning on buying another. Holy cow. I need to just invest in stock in Premier One. Um, I'm in I plan on buying another set of Premier One fences. Because a 25 by 25 I just don't feel like is big enough for to uh, a sow and a guild to, you know, rotationally graze well. I just, I don't feel like it's quite enough. Um, so that's the next step is where I'm going to buy another one. Hopefully it can be here in a week and we can get it set up before the following week. They'll be in that paddock for a week. We'll move them then again. Anyway, I digress. Um, the Chickshaw build has not got started yet. That will probably get delayed to end of June. The main projects that we want to get done. The Chickshaw build, the rotational grazing setup of the pigs. We need to get the next half of the barn. We need to figure out where we're... So that was a lot. I had a phone call. Anyway, um... I have no, no clue what I was saying. Uh, Lincoln's pre preparing to mow right now. And it's like, uh, holy shishito peppers up in here. It's like he gets ready to mow and the kids are like, mow! Because, oh, here he comes. Hello, lover. Yes, dear. What are you doing? Trying to film an intro to a video. You're fine. I'm sorry. You're fine. What's up? I'm pretty want to get stuff done. We interrupt this vlog for the sheer and total chaos that is the Ryan family. Okay, so. Again, I don't know where I'm at. I'm going outside to rake the weeds out of my garden, plant the shit stuff that I can. Plant the stuff that I can. Hmm. YouTube's going to be good for me. Yeah, it is. It's definitely going to clean up my act. Anyway. 
plant the stuff that I can and then I have to come in here and cook because he is gonna mow. Oh! No, it's fine. It's just, you know, everybody tends to like drop everything where it is. So whenever it's time to mow, then everybody's like, oh, well, that was laying in the yard. I saw it. We need to go get it. And that's laying in the yard, and that's laying in the yard. And I really just need to get it together and get like everything set up to where it's supposed to be and find everything a home because right now nothing has a home so it's all complete and total chaos like I have a vision for this place it's just not coming together yet but when it does it's gonna be awesome so stay tuned it's just gonna take a minute so I'm gonna go get my garden planted um, was going to tell you guys to, I am starting to shop for Bermuda. We are going to Bermuda in one month, literally one month from now, we are going to Bermuda. So if anybody has any like favorite outfits, every, any favorite like cruise ship, little things that they had to take, send them to me, leave me a comment, tell me what you took. Tell me that you normally get car sick and you're not going to get car sick, on the cru car sick on the cruise ship or seasick on the cruise ship. Tell me that. That's what I need to hear. So, if you have any suggestions, let me know. What? You can speak out loud. Okay. Where's Callan? In his room. Okay. We're going outside now. Hmm. Whoever said that getting chickens was a great idea was a big fat liar. Look at this. Do you see this big hole? I planted a peony right there. And it is gone. <sighs> Why? Why are they like this? Baby velociraptors. Pterodactyl. Flurfendergans. Ugh. <sighs> Come here, come. One of these days. She found a fence. It's hot. She does not love it. She peed her fur. Oh no, it's okay. Look at Ronan. Oy. I even did so. just remembered that I planted borage there and I think I dug it up. Did you know that vlogging and mowing don't go together? I did. Husbands don't. They don't know that. Oh, sorry. Okay, when he's done mowing, I'm going to take you outside and show you what I planted. More for my record than it is yours, but don't mind the Oompa Loompa redness in the face. When I get hot, I turn red. When I get cold, I turn purple. It's like a cool trick that I do. Thanks, Dad. Okay, I don't know if I will be able to get this done before he comes back up here. And here he comes. <sighs> Love him. I just wish he would conveniently mow quieter. My eyes twitching. <laughs> okay, he's going back down the hill. Hang on. For real, my eyes literally twitching. Okay, we're gonna do the best we can and hope that you can hear me because I'm running out of daylight and I have to finish dinner. I have the sausage, pat sausage patties made up. It is now after eight o'clock, so I've got to get in the house. Okay. Cliff Notes version. Boop -ba -doop -ba -doo. You walk in the garden. Listen, I don't know what he was doing, but he knows better than to distract me whenever I'm trying to vlog. Because first of all, my attention span is 
that of a goldfish. Second of all, this goat back here that you probably can't see very well jumping up on the chicken thing is really just throwing me off. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, woo! I'm certain you heard that. I feel like I know what that was, but I feel like I can't remember what that was. Anyway. Okay, so. When you walk in the garden, you will be approached by a lovely batch of tomatoes. So. Okay, so when you first walk in, this is a dahlia plant, and then my tomatoes will be on the other side of this fence wall. On this side, uh, I think I'm just going to do flowers, and then I have two tomatillos. Oh no, you know what I was going to do? Flower on the end, ground cherries, tomatillos, flower on the other end. Uh, if the tomatillos don't do well, I'm going to fill in with flowers and just make this a row of flowers and this a row of flowers. I have another plan for this, but I currently can't remember what it is. I have everything mapped out on my Grow Veg website. I digress. Tomatoes. Let's go over here. These are... Okay, so I have two of the Ukrainian purple. And then I have two Jubilee, which are a yellow. And then I have two of the Wisconsin 55s. And then I have two of the Thornburns terracotta, which are an orange. Now, of these four varieties, I have never grown any of them. Not a single one. So all of these are new varieties for me. I have 20 varieties of tomatoes that I will be putting in this garden this year. 20 and the majority of them ugh, he's gonna break that you can't see him Ronan ugh, he's standing on the chicken wire I'm gonna have to move them bro if you would stay on the tin that would be one thing but you're standing over here on the chicken wire and you're gonna break it I win. Haha, -ha, I moved him. So I just kind of wrapped him around the pole so that he can't reach it. For now. For now. We will fix it. But for now. Okay. So, thus far, tomatoes, one row of tomatoes are planted. Dahlias are planted. Tomatillos are planted. I have this fence line on the opposite side. So the sun's on this side. The opposite side is cabbages. On this side is okra. So the okra will hopefully shade the cabbages and hopefully help them grow better because I am going to be growing them in the heat of the day. Now, what I just planted tonight. Okay, so this, I don't know what you can see of this, but I planted two rows of strike green beans and then six different varieties of well no six zucchini plants three different varieties I had um, a bush variety that I got from drug mart I had a Genovese that I also got from drug mart and then I had two uh, different black beauty one is from Baker Creek and the other is from Drug Mart. So needless to say, there's a Drug Mart <laughs> right by where I work. And when I go in there, there's a ridiculous amount of seeds and I have a really hard time not buying them. So that is what is planted thus far in my garden. Um, I'd like to get my trellises up, get everything else planted, but um, I need to hub in. And so far, it's either raining or nice enough that he can mow. And we're trying to prioritize our time because working full time, kids having baseball, my husband coaches baseball, there's not a lot of time. Alright guys, that is all for today.
I'm going to actually cook the sausage sandwiches now and feed the tiny human. The tiny human. The. So. I'm a tiny human. She's a tiny human. Uh, but that's all for today. Thank you guys for hanging out with us. Thank you for learning with us. And we'll see you next time.